hello lovelies welcome back to my channel if you are new be kindly subscribe to my channel and if you are a returning subscriber thank you for your love and support in my previous video i said i was gonna be showing us how to make pure aloe vera oil remember from our previous video we extracted the juice from this aloe vera leaf that we applied on my toddler's hair also know that every part of aloe vera is so essential so if you have a complete aloe vera both the juice and the leaf you can as well use it to make your own aloe vera oil so right now i am scooping four spoons of pure coconut oil and that is what i'm gonna be using to extract my own aloe vera oil you can use any oil you can use castor oil you can use grapeseed oil you can use olive oil whichever oil you have access to it is okay now i'm gonna be dissolving the oil in the microwave using about 30 seconds <music> Obviously, I'm done dissolving the oil. I'm gonna be adding it to um, the aloe vera leaf that I've already placed in the blender, and I'm gonna be blending it all together. I'm so sorry I did not record the part of the blending. I didn't know what happened. My camera just stopped working. I'm sorry for that, and I hope you understand. Just blend it, and you pour it in a pot on the fire on the stove, and we're gonna extract. I mean the the oil from this um the paste we have on the on the stove. Just put it on the light. I mean uh light like a medium cook to make sure that it's the, the heat on it is not too much so we just cook and we begin to stir gradually gradually until you know we have the oil from it just keep stirring as you can see it's looking so yummy like uh <laughs> it's looking like uh green like green is it green pepper like you want to make green sauce like um yeah like green sauce so that's how you know it's gradually changing as you can see it took me about 15 minutes to 15 to 20 minutes to extract this oil because i didn't want it to get burnt so i my heat was so so low and i was stirring gradually 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 until i saw the desired oil i wanted so we keep stirring we keep stirring we keep stirring you know <laughs> until we get the pure oil from it is th isn't this awesome this is also because you know you get to use your own oil your own homemade oil and after this video i'm gonna be showing you how to make so many hair ingredients i mean hair improving uh um oils from your kitchen i mean from your kitchen many things you can use from your kitchen that will improve your hair so follow me don't uh um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe to my channel um share my videos with your friends and families with kids or friends and families who are trying to grow their hair let them see how they can use things from their own kitchen and cost effective way of you know applying natural ingredients to their hair that will boost the growth the shine and of course the overall health of their hair so i'm still practically staring this oil because i want all the aloe vera to completely dissolve in this oil so like i said earlier you can use any oil that you are so good with you can use castor oil you can use grapeseed oil you can use olive oil you can use coconut oil you can use any oil jojoba oil you can use any oil you so you know you're so you have access to so you can see it's gradually changing and the oil is coming out from it it looks yummy like i can use this to take like yum like yum stew <laughs> isn't this awesome this is so awesome so we keep staring so after 15 to 20 minutes you can see we have our pure aloe vera oil look at that so the moment you begin to see your i mean the paste right in the oil change color from green to let's say slight 
brown you can see it's slightly you know changing the color then you you should know that your aloe vera oil is ready so i completely added everything in that jar and i'm gonna be leaving it to cool off where i would transfer it to another jar that i would cook it up you know so i'm completely transferring to another jar so that you know it's gonna stay for 12 hours i left my own uh, mixture for 12 hours before i extract the oil from it this is our aloe vera oil so we'll leave this for 12 hours before we extract and right now i'm gonna extract the oil from it i just look for a paper towel and i place it under like a filter and i'm gonna extract the pure oil from the whole mixture i can't wait to show you how it looks it looks so beautiful i mean the beauty of having to make my own oil can you see that it's so green and right now i'm gonna transfer it to a bottle that has like a head tied um cover that also has like a spray you know nozzle that will be easy to use while applying the oil on the hair isn't this beautiful i mean look at that i'm gonna add essential oil i love true lavender you can use any essential oil. this is optional you can decide to add an essential oil and you can decide not to add any essential oil just a drop of essential oil is enough because essential oil irritates the scalp so you don't want to add too much essential hair but it is completely optional you can decide to add or you can decide not to add it still doesn't change the effectiveness of the oil now i'm going to be showing you how to apply the oil which is like an extra bonus to this video so you generously apply the oil to the hair i mean generously and completely massage it and you cover up with a bonnet and leave for one hour or more depending on how you can wait i mean one hour or more the more you leave it the better you know that this oil works for all hair types i mean both adults and children so much for watching and if you have not subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up and also share my content with your friends and families with kids or friends and family trying to grow their hair thank you so much love you bye bye